display will be on here at the Museum of Western Australia um, from the 24th. Hi, this is Mark from CTV. I'm speaking to Marlene from the Coalition of Peoples. Tell us about this exhibition you're setting up, please. Uh, this exhibition is um, actually three exhibitions, photographic exhibitions of Indigenous peoples throughout the world. Uh, this one here is about ourselves, Aboriginal people from Australia. And the other one is uh, photographic documentation, documentary uh, from po uh, Paul Weinberg of the San in um, the, southern, the Indigenous people of Southern Africa. And then the, there's the other exhibition, Once We Were Hunters, is from um, the southern parts of Africa. And so it's, a, it's really quite a dynamic exhibition. This is Namibia. This is in South Africa where people um, got their land back. This is in the central Kalahari where people still live today. This is an old man telling his life story. Part of the honouring the generations uh, section. Stories about um, our own people. The stories about uh, the different um, ideas about what is truth in our age. You know, there's um, that uh, they seem to think that truth is the belongs to the property of the nation, and I think part of this is part of that um, is that of telling that truth, and I think it's part of the reconciliation too of uh, the practice of truth telling. Um, what he says to us in the book is. In the olden days, the times were very, very good. Today we've gone back, 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 backwards. We've put down why, why, why. And you know, there are a lot of questions people ask about their, their lifestyle and why things have gone so wrong. Do you see any parallels between the African indigenous experience and our own indigenous experience? Oh, definitely. Indigenous people throughout the world share a common heritage, a common value system. Um, in Africa, it's different to Australia. The, the majority of people are indigenous. In, in Australia, the majority of people are not indigenous, although it's a contentious point, I know. Um, but when we talk about hunter-gatherers, we're talking about a very fragile community. In, in the modern world, um, they share the same fate often. They they're, uh, often lose their roots and um, become very marginalized in the world. Um, so I've seen that a bit in, in, in my limited experience of Perth and Australia. I've seen a bit of that as well. My main interest, uh, or a lot of interest, is um, about the contribution of Aboriginal workers um, to the growth of Australia. You know that it, um, people deny it, but it did exist. So there's all of these uh, documentations. We're setting these up as part of the exhibition to accompany the, um, uh, the photographs. It's sort of like a, um, the artwork and the people's contribution is putting their arms around these pictures and um, I suppose, you know, if you like to think of it in those kinds of ways is, is that the, the people now are painting parts of our own history. The display will be on here at the Museum of Western Australia um, from the 24th of January for a month.